Ah, this is good for you. I suggest force of nature. Hi guys, Anatoly here and today we're gonna take a look at manual lip sync or the way I do manual lip sync. Not necessarily the right way, but it's the way I do it. And people have been asking how I do it, so I'm gonna record this tutorial. All right, so we're gonna use this line right here. Ah, this is good for you. I suggest force of nature. All right, so this is a heavy line from Poké Knight at the inventory, and it's straight out of the game, so I have to convert it first because SFM doesn't like the format that they can blah 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 yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to use the same project that I used for the hat loving heavy. Just going to save it as. Uh, what should I save it as? I don't know. Oh, fuck, it's not responding. We. So, yeah, let's go to the shop. Oh, Ah, this is good for you. I suggest force of nature. Started a bit early. In the okay. Okay, so let's just bring everything to default quickly. Now we're good to go. Face, lower face and tongue. Extract phonemes. Ah, ah, this is good for you. I suggest force of nature. Well, I'd say that the detection is pretty much correct, but... For you. I suggest force of nature. I don't like it for the simple reason that it's not in keyframes and this is good for you. And just badly timed to be honest. By badly timed I don't mean that the phonemes are not timed with the sounds, I mean that the op the mouth opening and closing motions are not very pleasant to look at and they're not fast enough sometimes, they're not slow enough in other times and shit like that. Okay, so just Oh god. Okay. So yeah, the way I do manual lip sync is frames and curves. That's pretty much the way I do everything. 
so we don't need the secondary viewport for this. So more space for the sliders and procedural stuff. And we need to, yeah. Okay. So set a blank key. Very important. So um the first pass, so to speak, is done with um, basically just the built-in phonemes, yeah. Okay, so apparently it doesn't... Does he have a G phoneme? Or? Yeah, okay. He's good. Select the key before you use the sliders because um, it does the preset for the key that is selected. If not selected, it makes a new one. This was the first pass. Ah, this is good for you. I suggest force of nature. Looks plausible. Ah, this is
Okay, so I'd say for this tutorial we're done with the lip sync. Ah, this is good for you. I suggest force of nature. My goal was to show how I do it. This is how I do it. And right now, ah, this is good for you. It's not bad already. Just after one pass, and like, I guess force of nature. It doesn't need much refining after that, so it's properly timed, more or less. Ah, this is ah, this. Maybe this is a bit too. This is good for you. Ah, uh, this is good for you. I suggest force of. So yeah, let's render it out and see what happens. Okay, so let's render it in. 1080p since this video is going to be in 1080p and just never mind the settings because they're going to be low. No, don't overwrite anything. Wait, I forgot the name. I always forget the name and fuck shit up. Ah, this is good for you. I suggest force of nature. All right, so I'm sorry that this wasn't much of a tutorial because I'm not really that good at explaining things as I do them, but hopefully this will provide some insight into how I do things and hopefully some questions will be answered. So I'm thinking that next time we're gonna refine the lip sync and think of some animations we can add to this so till next time then <laughs>